Well, good Wednesday afternoon, everybody. It's been a warm and humid one out there ahead of a front that's approaching, and that front may bring some evening showers and storms to the area. It's going to kind of stall off to our south, so it might be a little bit unsettled here over the next 24 to 48 hours, but there are signs of a much better weekend to look forward to. Right now, it's 83 degrees outside the Beatsby studio. You'll notice it is quite muggy out there, and it's been generally in the 80s across most of the region, a smidge cooler down on the Cape as those southwest breezes have brought a little bit of a sea breeze down there, but a really nice beach day if you uh, are lucky enough to have the day off. Severe Storms Prediction Center has issued an alert for uh, some enhanced uh, severe weather that's possible across central western Massachusetts, parts of northern New England. That's where the focus area will be, but there could be a few of those renegade storms making their way down towards the Bridgewater area later on this evening. So something to keep an eye on. We do have severe thunderstorm watch in effect again. It is for areas off to our north and west. Nothing here as far as severe weather goes just yet. But again, as these storms move closer here this evening, there's something we'll have to watch. They're lined up right now, really, from uh, central and southern Vermont towards the White Mountains of New Hampshire, across most of central New York State and parts of uh, uh, east central Pennsylvania right now. There's a little bit of, quite a bit of lightning actually with this system right now. So that is something to keep an eye on. Uh, but again, you'll notice the trend is pushing more north and west. So uh, something that we'll have to monitor here over the next uh, several hours. But again, the heaviest weather will probably be north and west of 128. The front, as I mentioned, will stall just south of New England overnight into tomorrow. And along that front, we will have ripples of some drizzle, maybe occasional some showers, even some steady light rain off and on really throughout tomorrow and even into a portion of Friday. We're also monitoring activity in the tropics. This could be our next named system and is right now off the southeastern coastline. But most of the steering currents will uh, gradually take this system, bring it up north a bit, and then steer it out towards uh, Atlantic Canada. So I don't think this has any direct threat to southern New England, but it is something we'll monitor. It could kind of keep that front nearby even a bit later into Friday or into early on Saturday. That's uh, one complication that we'll have to kind of monitor with this system. It'll also give us a little bit of a breeze off the coastline. So that's something to monitor, and we will certainly do so. As for tonight, showers around, as I mentioned, lows generally in the mid-60s, a humid and muggy evening. Now, those showers continue off and on Thursday into perhaps the first part of Friday, and then the optimistic hope is that that will clear out of here Friday afternoon, setting us up for a very nice weekend.